What's up, ballers? It's Bobby Buckets, back with another episode of NBA Live Mobile. So as you guys can see, I'm actually on the account that I used the other day for my pack opening. So it has pretty much all terrible players, but I've subbed in the players that I want to play with. So we did manage to pull shooting lineup Mo Williams and shooting lineup Kyle Korver. And it's actually, this Kyle Korver is the best three-point shooting player in this game. So with the boost from the lineup, he actually has a 98 three-pointer. But we are going to be saving his review for later in the week. Because right now we are checking out throwback Mo Williams from 2009. So he's got 89 three-pointer and then plus two uh, for the lineup. So I'm pretty psyched to play with this card. And since I've only ever used this account for coin-making methods and pack openings... Everybody that we're going to be playing is absolutely awful. So I think the highest overall right here is a 59 because I only have 714 fans. Um, so this is actually going to be pretty entertaining. So we're going to hop on over. We got an 82 shooting lineup going against this 59 two-way lineup. So this is going to be a little bit unfair, but it's also going to be really fun at the same time. So I'm excited about it. Um, so pretty much we're just going to be dominating with... Mo Williams the entire time. I'm also excited to do uh, some gameplay gameplay with that Kyle Korver card because I think it's going to be pretty, pretty nice. Uh, and for some reason, it's taking a while to warm up. There we go. So we should win the jump ball. My gosh, why can't I win jump balls right now? Uh, I was doing some gameplay earlier, and I could not win the jump ball to save my life. This should be basically steals on every possession. Like if we score... Uh, it's automatically an absolute failure. So Mo Williams, step back. He should just be draining these because these guys are, yeah, 59s. They, uh, as much as this is unfair, it's also really going to be entertaining. I should be able to get a ton of steals too. Um, oh my gosh, I cannot believe we just gave up a three-pointer to a 58 Ronnie Price. Um, all right, so that should be money. What? I cannot believe that just happened. I just missed a wide open three pointer with Mo Williams plus ten against a fifty eight overall team. How does that make any sense? Please, please explain that to me, EA. I swear, if I lose this quarter, I'm I'm not gonna know what to do. Uh, let's see. We'll get it to Mo. Maybe his hot spot is at the top of the key. Maybe that's why I missed that first one. So plus six. There we go. Okay. So maybe we have to go more towards the uh, middle of the court whenever we're trying to hit those. Oh my gosh, are we going to give up another basket? Come on, get the steal. Oh, why is that a foul? That should have been a steal. Come on. We got to do better than this right now. This is this is kind of sad, considering the, uh, the difficulty that we're going up against. And also, why can't I get a steal? I mean, I know he's probably not like an amazing defender, but I feel like he should be good enough to steal from a 58. And that should be money. There we go. All right, so we're starting to heat up a little bit now. Let's get back. We got to get at least one steal in here. Come on. Give me the ball. Mm, my goodness. Come on, get the ball. Maybe Kyle can get it. Maybe not. Sorry if you hear all the tapping noise from me smashing my finger on the screen. We scored on again. Uh, although that is Gary Harris, so I'll give him some props. He's a, he's a Michigan State graduate. Let's see. That should be a three. And another three points. So it looks like... Looks like we might have a chance to get actually uh, up to 20 in this quarter. If I could get a freaking steal or a rebound, my gosh, this is this is so sad. I'm going to beat a 58 overall team by like 7 points or something like that. And we make that one, so if we can get a steal, it looks like we're going to be able to hit 20. That's, that's kind of our threshold for greatness right now. Uh, come on, get the steal, or at least let them score. Oh, there we go. Throw it up. Oh, my gosh. This is going to be a tough shot. Come on. Come on, hit it. Oh, my gosh. I thought he was going to make that. I did not think I was going to be able to get down the court that fast. All right. So we, we're pretty close on that one. We got uh, 17 points, so not quite to 20. We're going to do a little more driving on the next game. So, honestly, we need to do a little bit more defending, too. The fact that we were uh, – the fact that we were – even let them score seven points is just a problem. So we will go ahead and play with this lineup again, this time trying to do a little more dribble moves, some spin-diddy-spin. I can't believe I just said that. 
and I still can't win the jump ball. Uh, let's see. Get a steal. Oh, my gosh, if that goes in. At least we're getting rebounds, but then again, we're only getting rebounds like half the time. Spin move. Come on. You should be breaking ankles. There we go. That was what? 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 What is happening? Pass the ball. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Give it to him. All right. Spin move again. You got to make it, or we'll do a mid-range jump shot. All right. We will accept that, too. Um, man, not looking good right now. I'm not sure what's going on. Mo Williams is missing. Really? There we go. There's our steal. Let's give it back to him. Come on. Spin move. Dribble move. There we go. Why does he keep doing mid-range jumpers? I don't understand. You have a layup. Take the layup. And get the steal. Get the steal. Oh, come on. Give me the steal. There we go. Oh, yes. Free dunk. Maybe. Or what? I cannot believe he just did a jump shot when he was at the basket. And I definitely did the right controls. Fortunately, this guy is an absolutely dreadful ball handler, so it's pretty much free money right here. You know what? We're going to do a step back three because I'm tired. Oh, my gosh. Maybe a three from way downtown. Oh, that all right. That one was a bit of a long shot, but honestly, I should be making these shots right now. Come on. Oh, my gosh. We just got scored on by Marcelo Huertas. Cannot believe this is happening right now. I've scored four points. I have an 87 point guard, and he still keeps shooting mid-range jumpers. Okay, I think uh, I think Mo Williams is going to be reserved for um, jump shooting only because he just doesn't know what to do whenever he gets in the paint. It's like he's underneath the basket, and he thinks he's out at the three-point line. Come on, get another steal. Or just give up a basket. That's good, too. Come on, maybe Corver can get a steal. I know he's not known for his three-point shooting. Come on, get the board. There we go. We'll throw it up to Mo. And a little mid-range jump shot because he stepped on the line. Can we get one more steal before the end of this game? I guarantee you we are not going to hit that threshold of greatness, but I think we can get another shot. If they... Oh, he missed it. If he would have made it, I think I could have scored again. So, basically, in summary, I would say if you want to get Mo Williams... I would reserve him for ball handling, passing, and shooting. I would not try to drive with him, so I know a lot of Russell Westbrook cards are better at that. I would definitely not recommend trying that with the uh, Mo Williams card, but he's definitely fun to play with, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, if there are any more cards that you guys want to see some gameplay with, be sure to comment below, but please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time.